Director of the Ghana Tourism Authority, GDA, Kamrul Baksh, has noted that the cricket carnival season, which surrounded Ghana's recent hosting of the Caribbean Premier League, was successful. He said the GTA will continue to work with tourism stakeholders to capitalize on financial opportunities that can derive from this and other mega events. Speaking with DPI recently, Baksh noted that the agency will continue to expand the bed and breakfast program to facilitate other events that will be hosted in Guyana. September recorded the highest number um, ever um, in, in the history since we've been recording um, arrivals. So um, that is significant. That tells you that um, lo lots of persons were hitting here. Um, we knew that there was a capacity issue with, with the accommodation stock here. And uh, we, had to, um, we had to run a bed and breakfast program of which we availed um, about 237 rooms, of which 216 were booked. Small tour operators, restauranters and transportation providers, Baksh said, have noted increase in business. He said the Cricket Carnival provided the boost businesses needed following the effects of the COVID-19 pandemic. We're about 90 to 95% of where we were um, pre-pandemic. I think by next year, second quarter, we should be um, at that level or, or even surpassing that. All right. Um, so so that, is, that is quite significant. Um, we're, we're very happy, um, you know, that we were able to support the, the, the sector. Guyana will be hosting the CPL finals for the following two years and the GDA is actively working with the event coordinators to create activities that visitors can enjoy while here. Cricket Carnival was just a success, really. Um, you know, far exceeded the expectations of, of many who traveled to, um, you know, to be a part of the events. Um, you know, from the crowds alone, um, from the national concerts to the, to the private events, um, you know, everything was well executed. According to statistics released by the Chedi Jagan International Airport, there was a 90% increase in arrivals for September 2022 compared to last year.